So we're doing a quick walk around of this early 1970s Cascade Coach Company uh, camper made in Great Falls, Montana. Uh, double bed overhang on the over the cab. Hydraulic jacks. Propane bottle storage here. Single bottle, 20 pounder. Water fills here. Fills the uh, 10 gallon tank inside. There's a water drain from the kitchen sink. And there's a connector that goes to that to run, run the hose down to the ground so it's not pouring out the side directly. Hydraulic jacks all the way around if I didn't say that. Uh, 110 power supply cord, about 24 or 30 feet of cord. Um, these flaps on the back here, by the way, are designed to close it in on a, on a, a square body type Chevrolet or wider truck bed. This is a 1995 Chevrolet pickup that's sitting on, which has, this body style has a narrower tailgate. So the opening is a little narrow for these, but they can be trimmed or removed if it's going on a, a truck where they're, they're too wide. Um, mosquito netting on our mosquito screens on all the windows. You can see there's no hail damage and the siding and exterior is in pretty good condition. There's no leaks. There's a new rooftop vent on it. Um, just because the old one was cracked around the edges and so on, it didn't look that great, so I replaced it. For the year of this camper, it's in really good condition. S dual stainless steel sinks, manual pump. Um, three burner stovetop, propane. Furnace is here. Doesn't have a blower, but it's propane powered. Emits pretty good heat. Storage space underneath here, couple of drawers, more storage space here, here. Icebox refrigerator, so it's not propane or electric, it's just icebox, so you put ice packs in there to keep things cold or frozen food or whatever. There's the bunk area. Right now it's just got a like a three inch foamy mattress on it, but it's what it has right now. You could replace that. Closet and storage. Got a little shelf on the top and you can hang clothes from the edge here. Foamy comes with it. 110 power supply. This upper storage area can be used as it is, closed up, or it can actually fold down. It hinges along here. It has uh, like little deadbolt latches that hold it up in place. Now you reach in through the cupboards and release those and drop it down on these uh, on the brackets on the end. Table is removable and pedestal is removable. Uh, foam cushions get rearranged. Um, there's a there's a piece that fills in here, sits on these rails. It's hinged on the back edge here, so it just flips over, and then makes another bed there. Uh, there's the vent, and that's about it.